Hey there, how's it going? Well, there's a lot of great channels that people had mentioned. Not many of them were what I was really hoping for, but it doesn't really matter that much. There were a lot of great channels that people mentioned nevertheless. But, you know, there were some that were pretty much exactly what I was looking for, so... Hassan Piker's alright. Though, I mean, some of the things he said about that veteran was really bad, but, uh... So he sometimes gets pretty outrageous, but uh, he's alright. Tomska is alright, but he doesn't release videos very regularly. Philosophy Tube is alright. Pretty good. Very similar to ContraPoints, though. Lots of longer videos, but still good. Sean is great. I like his stuff quite a bit. Deep Fat Fried and Come Town seem alright, but they mainly do the podcast live stream type of format, and then they're sometimes very long, but they're all right. Sam Harris is good. I didn't realize he had his own channel, so that's cool. Sean Carroll, all right. But again, it's more of the long form, uh, lots of podcasts, lots of live stream type of format. So really long most of the time. Eric Weinstein, or was it Weinstein? Pretty good, but lots of very long videos, mostly interviews. Potholer54 is decent, I've been subscribed for a while, but he doesn't release videos very often. After School puts out a lot of interesting and thought-provoking videos. Mr. Deity is pretty good, his videos against PragerU are particularly good. Re-Education is quite entertaining, and has a wide variety. Thought Slime, I'm still not quite sure about yet. Secular Jihadists is interesting, though most of the material seems to be clips from Hangout-style chats. Cat Black, I used to hate a lot, but now I don't mind her so much. She's pretty good. I like Carlos Maza's new channel. Very entertaining. I laugh at a lot of the things that he does. Um... He's far more to the left than I am, but I still enjoy his stuff. I look forward to seeing what he is going to put out more. Cult of Dusty, yeah, he's all right, but he gets kind of cringy at some points and takes, uh, I don't know, he's just cringy sometimes. Democratic Socialist Zero One puts out some decent videos, but he doesn't put out videos very often. I like Three Arrows a lot though most of his videos are pretty long, though not exceedingly long. I especially really enjoyed his video against Black Pigeon Speaks. Bo of the Fifth Column is great. I highly recommend him. Kevin Logan is really decent when he makes response videos. Michael Brooks is good, though it is mostly in sort of a news style. Jason Unruh, or, or however you pronounce his name, he's all right, but his communist views get rather annoying at times. Brother Nero, or otherwise known as Dick Coughlin, puts out some good content, but most of his videos anymore are the long uh, hangout style videos. He doesn't make the concise videos that he used to make. Tom Hartman is decent, though it is mostly a news style. The Rational National, I need to check out more before I can really make much comment. I like the Humanist Report for the most part. Again, sort of, sort of news-like, but he's decent. Trey Melvin, I'm finding to be hilarious. I'm really enjoying his stuff. I'm glad, I, I was really happy to see, oh, the, the Caitlin Bennett video that he made I thought was hilarious. And he has quite a few subscribers. And I enjoy Chud Logic. I subscribed to him, I don't know, over the past couple weeks and uh, have enjoyed his stuff too. Anyway, thank you very much for all of the recommendations. It's always good to spread around good channels. Thanks so much.